Cancer is, is a horrible disease, I agree. Um, at the same time, you need good people, good doctors to help cancer patients fight this disease and, and beat it. Um, 20, 30 years ago, that was not possible for many different illnesses, but I would say by now we got a lot better and we're, we're having a lot more success in defeating many of these cancers and actually a lot of our patients are alive with even stage four cancer and they're doing really well and they're functional. Um, so um, it's, um, it's helping quite a, quite a bit of people. It's not unusual right now to have people who are about three or four years out of their metastatic cancer. So I keep telling my patients that always think about this <clears throat> as a chronic condition, um, just like diabetes or high blood pressure. Well, you cannot make the disease disappear and go away, but still we want to help you to transform this into a chronic disease where you still can live, um, stay healthy, and do well without, without complications. This is a, an evolving science. So it's shifting therapies fairly quickly. Um, now we have immunotherapy that's been utilized in many different cancers, and it's, it's getting very quick approval, and it's working beautifully well. Um, a lot less side effects than can be anticipated with the old cytotoxic chemotherapy drugs. Patients tolerate that very, very well. We're seeing more and more promising outcome. So uh, it's, it's uh, like I said, it's an evolving science, and we're getting a lot better fighting this cancer. Patients get attached to their oncologist. That's a well-known fact because they trust in us. Um, we, we're, you know, we're trying to save their lives. And I, I always treat all my patients like family members. And I try to spend as much time as possible because to me, knowledge is power. And the more and more that patient understand about their situation, their treatments, and where they're getting it, the more comfortable they're gonna feel about that. And I always keep telling all of my patients, keep a positive attitude about therapy because people who have positive thinking tend to do the best. I have a lot of passion about fighting cancer. Um, that's not only what I do for a living, that's really my, you know, my job in this life, that's my duty. And uh, like I said, nothing brings me more joy than, than you know, the challenge and um, knowing the fact that we're getting closer and closer and winning more of these battles and helping our patients.